watch out. Uh, hello everyone, I'm uh, doing the first time a uh, video about the uh, MGTOWN. Um, I'm from Finland, I'm 35 years old, and there's, there's no uh, sort of this kind of channel, MGTOWN channel that you have in the US, and it's, it, nobody talks about it. It's like taboo. I guess in the US still, but more in Finland. It's sort of like everything is about women and their rights, and, and <laughs> nobody talks about how they behave and, and is there something uh, that they should fix. Um, yeah, there's a couple of topics I want to talk about, but uh, it's I think like most in interesting thing is, is I'm single now, and but when I see a guys or my friends that who are in a relationship, and it's like I think I think what men and and women when they talk about the relationship. It's two different things, because men are really concrete. They said like, I go, I go store, and they will do it. They buy stuff to the home, or they buy a car, whatever. They will do it, and they don't complain. And it takes um, just you know a certain time a time when you go to the store. When guy go to the store, it's fifteen minutes. Buys everything and goes. But women go to the store, it's one hour. And same is in a clean house. Uh, in two hours. A man can clean the whole house, but if 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 a woman cleans house, it's whole day job, and they will sort of complain like it's, it was really dirty here. Actually, it wasn't because I was in uh, my previous relationship. I uh, uh, I I was doing major. Uh, I I went to the store and uh, I made the cooking mostly every time, and I didn't complain. And I, I did more uh, working hours than my ex girlfriend. But still, she was the one who came home tired, like, oh, it was a really tired day. And I was like, what the? I woke up two hours earlier and, and came home earlier because I went to uh, work earlier. And I went to this, um, a store and made dinner. And she comes and eats and complains. And I was like, we get all these arguments. Like, what the fuck you complain? I have done more. And I... I make more money, I pay more. It's, it was like, I was really frustrating. Like, what the fuck is this? And many times when, when because men don't complain that much. And, and, and <laughs> women, when they say like relationship, they want to talk. But they don't talk, they complain. They complain like, what? It, they should talk with um, with their friends about it. Why they always bring this baggage to, to guys? And many times I got like text message from my ex-girlfriend like, I couldn't understand. It was really a, a big message. Like I didn't understand what the hell is this. Like we we saw yesterday. She need to talk about this thing, and all I get really long text messages. Like what the fuck? And I don't understand a word. What, what what is this? And then then she sort of replied. They go, um, why couldn't we talk this um, like later on when we when we meet again at home? No, we have to uh, answer right now. Like what the it's. It's, it's like it's they have so much impulses that they can control, but it's guy's job to sort of sort of deal with. And I, I think that's the whole reason why women are seeking uh, really uh, not like alpha guys, but really um, strong and confident guys. What, why everybody every woman is looking for? Uh, um, really confident guy because they all are so screwed up. They want to have a, like dad figure. They they want to have someone to to um, so that they can um, who will uh, take after them. So that's why like nice nice guys don't finish last because they want to have a strong guy who will sort of. Cook. They, I think women want to um, have a guy that will command them. They want to have a guy who will shout, shout really really loud like shut the, shut the fuck up I think women want that and then they woke up like okay 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 and then they're like you know but it's always to say and the other thing is women are so always late every time they're late if they have if you have a time schedule to go not everyone not everybody let's say like 90 percent they're always late if you have to go like 12 o'clock and and then they're late again so that's good so and then they complain to 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 guy like uh, we have to rush whenever we go, but I think that's the most uh, sort of what why I'm single like 
all I see these single girls over there, and they it's it's like <laughs> like there's a really good guy in U.S. the Big John who does this midtown stuff, and it's it's really uh, he says like, do you want to trade your peace of mind to have a, like sort of like sex? You have to go, you know, choose. And it's really big sacrifice. Not about if you got married, let alone that like suicide. But uh, I think it is. It's if you think about it, all you have to, th- you you know, hear day after day the whining. And and I think that is why women want to have a relationship. It's it's it's, it's they they sort of want to have the control. And and if if you think about girls anyway. If it, uh, how many how many women have a good time by themselves? Not not so many times. They go shopping, but they're not, they're not actually having a good time. Good good times comes when when there's a, a guys around. Guys always make the fun stuff, and women participate. But never never like there's never fun girls alone. If you put uh, five girls to the same room, is there fun? No, because they. All, they have conversation, but they cannot unwind. They don't know how, you know. And I think it's really, really fun. If you think about it, how many female bands are there? Like, whole band is only only girls. I don't know one. I mean, like the one who would be together like ten or plus years. I know many guy bands like Metallica, ACDC, Bon Jovi, Brian Anderson stuff. They've been together for twenty years because they have a great time and. And and they don't complain, but women band, they, it's it's not gonna work because they have like Spice Girls, they have issues that they're really stupid, and and uh, they just cannot be together, and and I think that's the whole reason. Um, the uh, many, if if you think of having a good time, that usually a group of guys going to a cabin or a bar or or to travel somewhere. But just the guys, and we have a great time, okay? But I've heard many stories, and if, if you take the uh, girlfriend with on trip, so it would be five guys and five girls, everybody would have a girl, girlfriend. It would be disaster the whole trip. It, disaster. It, it just doesn't work. But women want to come along because that's the only time they have good time. <laughs> and I, I think it, it just is. It's they're, it's they're coming really serious. I think like. Um, women plus forty are are full of worries and just really uh, low self esteem. They they are so worried about everything. They don't listen to music that much. They don't play any computer games. I love to play. It's really fun. They don't do any fun stuff. So that's why they complain so much. Because if you think about young girls, twenty or something, they hang around lots of guys and there's lots of fun. You know, and they're 20, 20 years old girls really fun, or 15, they're really fun, they have fun all the time. But when you go higher, 25, 30, 40, 50, and then it's like, and it's, 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 their life becomes too serious. Guys always like do simple stuff, concrete stuff, they build something, they play music, it's, you do stuff that you enjoy. But women just want to have like babies, pets. You know, every every single girl have like at least a cat or you know dog, and they're worried about the dog all the time. Full of worries, full of worries. Wake up first thing in, uh, in the morning is the dog. I I, I listen to music when I wake up, so it's, it's I'm having a great when I woke up. Like all right, great day is coming. But women like no way. <laughs> so it's I think it is. It's um if you think when you, when you're single, what what kind of relationship do you want, and and. Tell that they, if they if, if they would be a relationship, and they would be together over twenty years, it doesn't matter which time they have meet. But let's say like they are they are a really fresh couple, so starting when they're twenty, and then be together to twenty years, twenty years. So now they are forty now. So I don't know a single couple that would have a great time. Twenty years, it's it's just it just doesn't work. It's it's it's. No, but I have lots of friends um, that I have known for twenty years, and there's I, I love to hang around with those guys. So, but it, it's if you think about the same girl twenty years, and it's it's just I, I don't think it's just 
too much uh, complaining and you if everything comes like how would I say um, routine everything become routine so why would it be lots of fun so I think like all this meet time stuff is great and luckily I heard about this I'm 35 and I, I haven't been married I don't have kids so you know it's uh, it's woken me up I know I know the conflict uh, how you say like um, um, what um, things would happen if you got married there's like if now I understand like okay it could happen like this so I'm sort of uh, prepared for that but when I was 20 I didn't uh, never heard about this one and how women change when you're 20 to 40 it's like they're a different person so so it's really interesting and uh, and I don't understand why I never heard about this never it's like uh, like six months ago I heard about Miktan first time. Okay, it's that it, it doesn't happen here in, in Finland. But anyway, it's it's really it's something never in newspapers, never. But uh, there's everything about the about the women and and and, and how how they should be protected and 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 how, how, if there has been some violence at home, it's always like the guy's fault. So it's 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 really uh. Um, sort of dangerous to be, be a guy these days it's it's uh, it's it's it is a sort of women's world in a way because of the um how society works and and how the um government uh, take care of women but not the guys a guy is always the pay and and like i was in previous places i paid all the time i didn't complain but i, I thought it was like it was sort of the um, my um, role to pay more. I, I don't know why I did pay. Every time we went to restaurant, I paid. And, and, and but maybe because I made more money, I thought about that I should pay. But when I think about now, like, what, what the women want to have, like, equal, equal life. So, fuck it, let's pay equal as well. And, and, and always, like, the best business tip is to guys, like, do not, um, Sort of uh, put business and, and girls in the same page, or the, you know, it's keep it separate because it's 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 if, if you think about women, I would say some money, you know, I'm 35, but if you think about average woman who's 40, 40, 40 years old, I think they're broke, nobody has any money, and and I think and if you think about that, guys, guys has money, you know, uh, and that's really weird and because women don't want to uh, think about 10 plus years they don't want to because it's scary because they look the, um, the appearance will drop so it's, it's like you know they don't want to even talk about it but you know it's really really weird that it's, it's uh, these things um, haven't been uh, discussed before at all and I have like a um, couple other things that I'm not right now at this, but I will do another video online. But I want to talk about a marriage, what kind of deal that is, and how women change when they are 20 to 40. I think it's, it's, it's the I think biggest, biggest sort of reward to be a guy is uh, when you're 40, you have everything ahead. I think men work hard when they're 20 and plus a whole year, a whole, whole life, and when they're 40, things will start happening. And appearance for the guy is really good. So that's one thing I want, it's for separate stuff, but you know, that's as a topic. And, and it's kind of weird because without YouTube, I would never have even heard about these things. So, but as my topic this, this time would be more like the whole relationship stuff, like I said before. It's like I, I didn't understand because all oh, what I heard with I've seen other couples um, who have kids and stuff and not kids doesn't matter but they have been um, let's say more than five years together and all I hear is women complain more or less but it's really I don't understand when I see the guys with their girlfriend how they come up with that it's like no way it's it's it's, it's really um, I sort of feel bad about, you know, some of my guys. So it, they they don't know better, in a way. And um, it's it's really if you think about the rest of your life with that. 
and and how it influences the whole whole your um, uh, whole your life if you feel in shit at home. You know, you drink maybe more, you eat you know bad stuff. And I started playing guitar and singing when I was divorced, like like three years ago. Then I woke up like, what 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 I want to do in my life? Because all the energy went went at home. So now I like more, I have more space, more peace. And I, I can do whatever I want to do, and nobody controls or tells me what to do. And and at home I can like um, write my diary and think like what I want to accomplish in my life. But it's really hard when a woman around. Then like you get so so much uh, information and complain. It's really hard to concentrate. So if it, if you think about it, it, is it worth to be in a relationship? And what, what kind of girl would be? Maybe there are like super girls out there, but you know, it's, it's a really rare. And uh, it, it, I don't think it's sort of it's worth it. You know, if if you think about it, maybe when you're really around 40 something, you want to have kids, then you know, take a relationship. But when you're like less than 40, do you really want to have a relationship? Or you, do you want to practice hard what you want to accomplish in your life? You know, if you, if you have to choose, and um, I think many people just take a relationship because that's what all the other guys do. So Miktan is really good, like they, you know, go in your own way, and um, I think I think that's really important but, because otherwise you re you re regret uh, regret what happened when when if you woke up and you're like sixty years old, you woke up, you are sixty. And you work hard, really fucking hard, and you pay your kids and your wife, everything. That's great, but you know your your train sort of went. Now you're sixty. What now? You know, it's, it's, and 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 if, if you wanna start playing guitar and sing, it's sort of a bit too late. So you know, we all have the same time and energy. Twenty four hours, everybody has it, but uh, but. It, if you have a girlfriend, complaining girlfriend, is it, is it, do you really have 24 hours or do you have less? And uh, can you make the decisions that you really want to do? Because I think like a relationship, it starts going down when you're moving together. I think that I heard like couples, they're going pretty well, but they're not living together. Even though it's cheaper to go living together, but it doesn't actually make it you know, good for you. There's someone always at home, never privacy. You don't have your own time because you work and then you come home. You always was there. So, so you know, even though it's maybe cheaper to be together, or is it because you're the guy? And I would say also it's it's like um, I think in relationship, men are really I think really humble. Men are really humble, but men are a little bit uh, attention and uh, something happened in the bedroom. And, and things like that, really simple stuff. But we, I think women want more. They, they have their own issues. They want to talk about too much, you know, it, it, not racist stuff, like they want to complain. And men are stronger, so we carry more stuff. Men uh, are more handy at home. We, we do stuff, build stuff. And, uh, and we protect because men are strong. So if something happens, you know, guys sacrifice you. And uh, we, um, yeah, we paid more. So it's it's like women have nothing but the game in relationship. But what what actually, if if you put sex and and warm besides, so that's equal. We both get warm and sex. So it's, you know it, that's equal. But guys have to pay more, carry more, do more, and listen more than girls. So it, it's I think that is uh, the whole point. Like women gets more in relationship than guy. I would absolutely would say that. You know, I, I, it's just my opinion. I'm 35. You know, maybe I'm wrong, but I, I, for my experience, what I've seen couples, I've seen pretty lots of couples. I think that would be the fact that women gain more in a relationship, and that is why they want to have a relationship. And women has to control in the relationship. Why? Because uh, unless you're using uh, condoms all the time, women has the power decision sort of. I heard many times like this, uh, uh, how would you say, um, so, uh, sort of unexpected child is coming. Oh, surprise. Like, what the, what the fuck is surprise? 
it, it's you violated my right because we didn't plan the kid, and now it's, she's pregnant. So it's it's like really, women has all the cards when you relationship. They have all the cards, and you have nothing. Uh, well, your wallet, but you know, I think that's really sort of it's scary actually when I think about it, and uh, you know, because it's men and, and women don't uh, think the same. I think most of men are really, you know, nice guys, and uh, they wanna, you know, they have really, really uh, small things that they um, would be happy. If you think like sort of Sim uh, Homer Simpson the Simpsons, I think most men are like that, really simple and humble, and just have a couple of beers and and you know, sex any now and then. And men are happy, but women are don't. So it's like uh, I think it goes like that. But uh, but I'm really, really happy that I um, learn about this MGTOWN stuff and I would hope that in Finland there would be more conversation like this and, um, and I have you know, heard so many inspirational stories um, so it's, it's just my uh, contribution to the, all this operation and I would like to if somebody um, would uh, put comments on it, that would be great to hear like um, what do you think? And am, am I um, overreacting or not? <laughs> so it would be nice to hear what the guys say. But uh, you know, it was really refreshing um, to be able to speak free. Uh, and uh, I think uh, I wasn't, you know, overreacting. I think uh, I think that's uh, how the things work. But yeah, you know, just it was great to, you know speak it out and uh, just have a great day and um, hope you uh, comment over there so I can write back. Gotcha.